Welcome back, friends and family, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube. Uh, it's been a little bit before, uh, since I've uploaded some content, but uh, I was kind of building up for a mail day because I've, I've bought some really neat things and I wanted to share with you. I have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine and ten that I wanted to share with you guys. Um, there's two big ones in here that, uh, yeah, that's not one. That okay, I see where, where they are now. All right, so let's get to ripping anyway. One, there's, there's two big ones that I wanted to save. Oops, for last. Um, because one of them, two of them are about... 70 bucks for individual cards, 80 bucks, something like that. And then another one was 150. Oh man. Got another box. Well, ain't that something? A bag in a box. All right. There you go. 1991-1992 Upper Deck. These things are going up. I love doing these. I buy those quite a bit. Alright, next box. I think that box cost me 35 bucks. They used to only cost me 20. Right, oops, camera got knocked. I'll do this here. And a bag. A bag inside of a box instead of a box inside of a bag. And then there's another box inside of here. Holy cow. Wow. And another bag. These old peeps, man. The box would have been good enough. Just one single box, ladies and gents. All right, so it was sealed, which I wanted to keep it that way. Now it's not sealed because of the terrible bag job there. Anyways, maybe I'll just crack it and go for another sealed one. I was going to keep it. It's a 1990-91. Hoops. I was going to keep it, throw it in the back closet, um, but now I'll probably rip that one and just buy another one. Still need that Sam... Vincent PSA 10. Still hunting that down. I should just buy it outright though, because it's only 80 bucks instead of continuing to buy those boxes. But I do like ripping them, so it's not a big deal. And last box 91 92 Skybox. I'm probably going to rip these live for you guys because I really like these. Alright, so those are the three boxes. We got, what do we got here? Oh, are you kidding? Are you kidding right now? A bag inside of another bag. And this stuff doesn't even, that wasn't even my stuff. That wasn't even my address. That's so weird, dude. This packaging is getting, getting crazy. Okay, so... These are the Phenomenal Beginnings ones. Uh, this was a card set of 20. From what I can see, they're not that great of condition. But that could just be the bag. I hope that's the last one that's like a triple bag. All right. An official tamper seal, huh? Okay. Got a Zach Randolph refractor, rookie refractor, tops. That's uh, 204 of 750. This, I think, it only cost me like two bucks. I was hoping that it was going to be in really good condition. It looks pretty good um, because it's going to go towards my. Semi-star slash superstar rookie grading. 
And there is, this one is of 250. This is Zach, again. It's an awesome refractor. Um, tops. We have a Shaq die cut, 96, or uh, 97, 98. It looks like it's not in very good shape. It looks like there's two of them in there. Or it's just really strangely cut. Kind of curious now, because that looks like a double card. Yeah, this isn't really... What? It, oh. That is not Tower of Power. That is not what I thought it was. Okay, well. It is what it is. It was only like 99 cents. I thought it was a straight die cut. It was the first time I ever bought that. And the last time. And then this was only 99 cents as well. Nolan Ryan. It was a die cut. Fleer 3000 hit club. Sorry for the glare, guys. All right. It's going to get better, I promise. This is a Kobe lot. Kobe White. Really? Oh, this is there's some other stuff in here too. There's some Jordans in here. Dang it. I really hate it when people use scotch tape. It's the worst. Please use painter tape or masking tape. I think I've mentioned this before. All it does is make for everything to be extra difficult. We got it. <laughs> Does not make make for fun opening, that's for sure. All right. Kobe Crusade Silver. Uh draft picks silver. Draft pick silver. Instant impact base. We got three of those. Base um, Crusade insert. Two of them. We have a Panini. This is just a regular player of the day basketball. I don't know where this came from. I like it though. It's like a rainbow color. Uh, regular hoops. My house, my house prism. This one. I hope this one turns out good. Red, white, and blue. The centering looks really good on it. I hope that one turns out good. Um, and then I got these two for 99 cents. Can't can't go wrong with that. Then we got the uh, Jordan upper deck. I'm looking at the symbol. It looks okay. 2006-2007 UD Reserve. Upper deck reserve. Looks like it's in pretty good shape. I'll pull it out, look at it. I got it. Uh, it, was, it was cheap. But I got it because of that refractor type. And then we got the yellow Dollar Tree LeBron James. And then we got a Michael Jordan's Fleer Tradition for the Wizards. Um, I liked this one too. This one's I, I believe this is only 99 cents as well. I like this one too because it's got the old uh, 1991 Fleer, I think. Nine, nine, yeah. It took a week to ship it. I was waiting on that one for a long time. All right. This is uh, me working on my 1986 set. These were a pick your card. And so I didn't... And see, they weren't this off-centered when the picture popped up. So otherwise I wouldn't have got it. But I got these for two bucks a piece. Extremely off-centered. This one is okay. This one's okay too. So I'm looking for eights, basically. So, oh, crap. All right. Well, that's not going to work. Too bad. If I was a returning person, I'd send that back because those are not what was pictured. 
All right. <clears throat> As you can see right on the top, there's a weird card. <clears throat> this is a... Oh, it's a Jeff Hardy card of 50. And I got this uh, because I wanted to actually put this next to the autographed hat that's back there. So I'm going to put that in a stand and then put that in there. It's a nice looking card though. I got Chris Paul of 149 contenders. Um, Mark Jackson card with the uh, Menendez brothers back there. 99 cents for that. Damian Lillard, fast break, 99 cents. Stargazing, optic, Jokic, hollow, 99 cents. DeAndre Ayton, rookie, 99 cents. Um, I forgot what that's called. But I figured, oh, that's pretty neat. I figured uh, for 99 cents, uh, it's good to have. Anyways, uh, Glenn Robinson, the third rookie. This is some kind of cracked ice. And he's, I don't know what that is, but um, it's obviously part of his jersey or or his t-shirt. It's a nice card. It was Again, that was only 99 cents. Same thing with this. Mitch McGarry. It's uh, 25 of 25, but it's that three-color patch. Auto. Go good in one of the lots. And now, we got the two big ones. I am going to do this one first, because this is just one single card. Got this for 150 bucks to add to my PC. Super stoked about this one. Super stoked, bro. Um... Kind of figured I I knew what it, I knew it was gonna go for 150, but it went for 150 because I was the last bidder. <laughs> Probably would have went for 130 or something like that. <clears throat> Let's see what we got here. Bam! I'm gonna take it out of the team bag. It is a 2008. Tops Treasury, Kobe Bryant, Bronze Refractor, Gem Mint 10. And this is of $9.99. Man, can't go wrong with a Kobe Refractor, right? Alright, that goes in the PC. And last package. This one's got some MJs in it that I was really, really excited to get. Uh oh, uh oh, that is not what I thought. Wow, that is interesting. That is really, really interesting. Those are like box toppers or something. Okay. Oh, so we got the um, Dwight Howard die cut rookie, rookie die cut. This is not numbered, uh, but I was gonna look it over. And it doesn't look like it's worth grading because it's got some whiting, but it'll still go in my top in, in my uh, rookies box, rookie die cut. And then we have this one here: Michael Jordan, Royal Court. Let's see if we can get in there. There you go. That's why I got that bad boy, man, because it looks so cool, man. Look at that. All right, that was, I paid about $20 too much for this, probably because of what, what's going on, um, but I've been wanting this one for a while. All right, these are big. I did not think these were this big. I thought these were normal cards. Did not do my research, <laughs> but still really cool. Penny Hardaway. Uh, die cut. It looks like it's a box topper. Authenticated memorabilia. Well, it's got Jordan on the back too, and that's of five thousand. Nineteen ninety six limited edition of five thousand. Still pretty sick. I like it. I like it. It's very interesting. And these, I you know, I was gonna grade these too. And here's the here's the other one. Bam. Look at that bad boy. 
Now, see, on the images, they looked like normal cards. I was like, oh, I got to have that. I got to have that. Seriously. I thought it was a card. I was going to grade it. It looked great from the picture. It looks great here, actually. Um, That's a 5,000 as well. But I think I might just put them on the shelves like this. Those look really, really cool. Anyways, that's the mail day. That's the mail day. Okay, I got a couple more things uh, coming up here soon, but I wanted to knock this one out is I've been itching to open this stuff, open this stuff up for a minute, and I've also been itching to give you guys some content and uh, to share in that mail day. And uh, yeah, bam, bam, good stuff. All right, thanks for joining me. Like, sub if you want. Comment if you have any questions, right down below. And uh, I'll see you soon.